have this error on your iPhone right now that says an update is required to use cellular data on this iPhone. And when I go back under settings, under cellular, it shows error. So when I open it up, can you see it? So I'm going to tell you the fix that you need for iOS 15 and 16. And this often happens when you're doing a fresh installation or when you update your iOS. So first off, you want to put off your airplane mode and put it back on. So I'm going to swipe from the bottom here and then I will hit on the airplane mode to put it off. So what this does for you, it resets the entire uh, network for you and you put it on again to see if the error is corrected. So we'll hit it again to, to put it on. So all we are trying to achieve is to reset the network connectivity. So another pattern that you want to try is you come to settings. So you come to settings and then you you will hit on them. Um, airplane mode just put it on just put it on and then wait for some seconds and um, put it off again so all you are trying to do is to reset your your network settings now when you do this you check if the error has been corrected if this error is not still corrected so the next thing you want to do is you want to check if your carrier sent you a message to update so if Serpent doesn't work for you, you try this step too. So all you need to do at this point, you come to settings. We are already on settings. Then you go to general. So scroll down. I will go to general. So once you get to general, the next thing you hit on about. You go to about. And then there's supposed to be a pop-up on your screen right now. If your carrier is asking you so take note that i'm connected to 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 wi-fi so if your your carrier sends you a message to update your, to update your network so you're going to receive a pop-up here and you will tap on it and then it's going to resolve um, the issue so if you don't see any pop-up you want to try it again go to about and open this page again if it will pop up but if you don't see any any pop-up then you need to move to the next steps so the next step you want to try is you want to remove your SIM tray by doing everything possible to reset um, the network settings. You go to your SIM tray, take your ejector a pin, and then you push it in. You take it out, and then you put it back in. All you're doing is what to reset the network settings because the iPhone will receive a signal that you just ejected your SIM tray. So if this error still remains after, the next step you want to do is to force a restart. Force a restart. And the way you do that is watch closely. You hit on the top button and hit on the down volume button almost immediately and press and hold on the power button or this right hand button here. So we'll do that and you do you hold it down until your screen turns blank. So let's see it up, down, and then you hold it down until the screen turns brown so it's going to tell you slide to power off do not slide just keep holding it down till it turns off and after some minutes if it doesn't still turn off then you have to try it again you probably didn't hit th those buttons fast enough it has gone blank and it will restart resolve then we'll move to the next step so the next step we're going to do, we're going to go, go to settings. Once I open up settings, I will go to general. Scroll all the way to the bottom and hit transfer or reset iPhone. And then you tap on this first option that says reset. And then you go for this option that says reset network settings. So you enter your passcode for the reset to take place. So you see, if I hit on reset network, it will reset my network settings, but it will not delete any data from my phone. If all these steps didn't work for you, we'll do go for the very last one and see if it works. We'll hit on general, and then we'll go to software update. So when you go to software update, it will load and check if you need to update your device, it says, 
that my ios is up to date so guys one of these methods should work for you let us let me know in the comment section which of these methods work for you and then we'll see how we can give you more details don't forget to hit the subscribe button like and share this video